The headlines in recent years, dead soldiers killed in Iraq. Dead soldiers indoctrinating a child at five to die in Iraq. Now, believing that the dead soldiers were being punished by God, which frankly makes me sick to my stomach, to spout rubbish like that, waving banners, to hold a sign up saying, private country, most private country, private country. You are standing there, madam, with the most private country, and you're smiling about your country. And this hall, not a bit like yours, thank oh, goodness. Yeah. Tell you what I find extraordinary. Oh, Would yeah. it be not fair then to say that surely you're preaching hatred and evil in the name of your country? As a father and as a man, I think it's quite possibly one of the most disgusting things I've ever seen in my life. The clip shows how Shirley, now openly preaching, descend on a grieving family's most private cunt time. I was brought up with nobody by my mother. You may shake your head, but at the end of the day, the only people I believe that is going to help with Jehovah's Witnesses, and that's what the Bible says. As if that wasn't shocking enough, take a look at what the church leader, Shirley's father, Fred Wusp, recently had to say. For the way they have persecuted us at Sodom in West Virginia, in America, the Lord sent a world-class sodomite to Virginia Tech, drawing headlines like shocked, horrified. The Lord God has punished our father, 33. And the others of a church. Please join us after the break, live via satellite link from America. What we're doing is, is we're helping you to understand plainly a discussion about what motivates us. His hatred, perfect hatred. That the standard set by your God is non-negotiable, straight to hell. He expects you to obey it, and if you will not obey it, you just better admit that you hate God. 